I said, let me find <laughs> Welcome, <laughs> Welcome back to the Cardinal Turf. I'm Jesse. I'm Paris. I'm Olivia. I'm Elena. I love the enthusiasm. <laughs> I'm so pumped. It was, it was, it it was like high and then. Mm -hmm. It is high. It started, it started high and then just yeah. slowly oh. declined. <laughs> so happy Valentine's Day, everyone. It's a very happy Valentine's Day. Yeah. We're all very festive. Exciting. Festive. We are very festive today. Oh my god. There you go. We're going to like someday get the hang of this. <laughs> um, someday. There you go. So, what's up? I hope everyone is enjoying their shirts and cookie. Yes, we got those they delivered. Got, got those delivered yesterday. So that was good. Yeah, fun thank stuff. you for ordering. Yes. I think I think we had how many orders? Like hundred. Well, we had like fifty shirts, and then some people got more than one cookie. Mm -hmm. Cookies, yeah. yeah. So yeah. we had a lot of fun. We put those orders together. Was it Monday? Monday and Monday. Tuesday. Yep. Wait until the last minute. <laughs> Kind of. Well, we're we working on the shirts the whole yeah. time. Yeah. Well, yeah. We didn't order our shirts until we got everyone's orders. So the cookies look so good. The cookies were good. Like, I had my, one those yesterday. Those are my favorite type of cookies. I was yeah. given one, but I haven't eaten it yet. They're the best. The crystal, the crystal natural cookies are the best, <laughs> hands down. Sure. Um. So, what's your guys's Valentine's Day plans? Like, are you doing anything today? Um. How about we start over there? Okay. Oh, okay. Jesse's gonna plan the whole gonna the date right now. Right no, because like <laughs> it's gonna, he's gonna get inspiration so, from our friends. <laughs> <laughs> it's so hard to do because I'm in sports, and then like Tia, it's just so hard. She doesn't even have a car yet, so like mm -hmm. it's really hard to do stuff. So we'll probably just hang out, watch a movie. Got you. I'm not sure what I'm doing yet because I I told Brennan either he has to plan everything and we go out or we just stay in. So I'm. Long for the ride. That's so fair. Um, yeah, me and Ethan celebrated <coughs> last night, and we went to Effingham, and he paid for my nails because my nails are so <laughs> oh. grown out. I don't know if you guys remember, but they were like very badly grown out. So he got my nails, and then um, we went to Fujiyama, and then I Roll King. Fuji. Oh, because <laughs> we had to balance it out. Guys, nails I've only, and Roll I've King. only been to Fujiyama that, twice. Not the same. Really? That's He's also only been to Julian's like once. I've <laughs> only been to Julian's once. I guess it's not your way. Like, you wouldn't I, go. No, I, I'm like never in Florida. Yeah. Like, yeah. the only time yeah, I really go to Florida is like when we went to the gym for baseball. That's about it. Yeah, other than CEO, like, I don't go the Florida direction either. No. Like, like I really don't know yeah. a lot of Florida people. Ever since I stopped working there, I'm like never there. Yeah. Yeah, I always feel like I go Effingham yeah. direction. There's just more to no, do there. Like, I went to yeah. Walmart. Um, Sunday to get like all of my gift and stuff. Mm -hmm. um, that's the first time I've been there in a long time. Yeah. Yeah. I went the other day because I hung out with somebody from Florida, but we never hang out, so I'm never there. Yeah. And like where us three live, it's like almost the same yeah, distance exactly. to Ebbing yes. and Florida, so yeah. like there's no it's point. It's, going to it's like it's 20 minutes 20. to Effingham and 20 minutes to Florida. Yeah. yeah. So it's like the same. Which is kind of nice, I feel Effingham, like. And Effingham yeah. has so much more stuff, so you're not gonna go to Florida. Yeah. Yeah, yeah that's true. Like, my mom only has to go to Walmart. She's going to Florida because it's smaller and there's... Yeah. 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 But, like, if she has other things, to do, it's like, go to Effingham. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. For sure. Paris, you did something last night. And yeah. you have Valentine's Day plans, too. So, last night, me and Charlie went to an Illini game. That was his birthday gift. So, he had tickets to go to this Illini game. And that was a lot of fun. Did they I win? Had, they did win. Like, 90-something to, like... What was it like sixty? Ninety and something to sixty something. Which yeah, that's pretty. Like, yeah, I don't remember the specifics. Oh yeah, that's pretty like average for college. College. Right? Yeah. Like they get higher scoring um, games. They played Michigan though, and Michigan's yeah, football good. is yeah. elite, but their basketball. <laughs> yikes! I was like, that's man, like, Illini is good. Like. That's how it is for like all schools. So like, you know, for like our Illini team, it's basketball all the way. Basketball's our yeah. best. Yeah. But like mm -hmm. in Michigan, Michigan's football all the way. So like. Yeah. There's never, yeah. There's, no, there's not a whole lot of colleges that are good at everything. Yeah. Well, and sure. most people, like, if they're going to go to a college for basketball, they'll go, they're going to pick somewhere that has a better basketball team. Yes. Exactly. Yes. Or a exactly. better football team. Exactly. So it's like. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, no, that was really cool, though, because I had never been to, like, I went to an Illini girls game because I did this, like, gymnastics cheer camp. 
um, at Illini when I was like seven. My mom took me up there for a day and like I got this t-shirt and like I remember cheering on the floor and then we got to meet the girl basketball players but like I had never like been to a boys game before. I've, I've never been to an Illini game but I have been in the stadium mm -hmm. to a Harlem Globetrotters game. That was oh, awesome. Cool. That was like the best experience. <laughs> that was awesome. So like I, I don't remember a lot from the game. I remember like you know they always have the small basketball players uh -huh. that are re that are really good. He spun the finger and held it on my hand, and I got a picture of that. And I remember this guy. He jumped up on top of the basketball hoop and then did a backflip back onto the ground. Oh my goodness, that's that. scary. Yeah. And like you know how it's like, like your core memory. For yeah, this. I know. I know. This <laughs> is like, this is like inside out core memories. Like. This is like, and then this is the yellow ball. This is yeah. the yellow ball. Um, like you know how like the refs and the players like they have like they'll they'll like argue for fun and uh -huh. like they did that the whole time. It was just hilarious. It was <laughs> so funny to me. That's great. But I'd much rather say online I game though. So oh, then, yeah. what are your Valentine's Day plans? Since you're avoiding the question, I just we just talked about it. But you never said yours. Like I'll we'll probably just hang out, watch a movie. Mm -hmm. Oh, and then Paris, what are you doing tonight? So tonight, I don't think we're actually going out tonight because Charlie's at the Farm Machinery Show that's in Louisville, Kentucky. So that's going to be a late night for him. But I think we decided on Friday we're going to hang out, which I told him I have stats homework. And he's like, well, we could just sit on the couch and do stats. And I was like, you know what? That doesn't even sound like a bad plan. I was just like, but um, he had this date planned and it's like two hours away, he said. And, I, and he was like, you know what, I think that'd be better to do in the summer. And I was like, okay. And, like, I don't even know what it is. But I think we're planning on going in the summer now, so we're just going to hang out on Friday. I got so. all my stats done this week. You did? Oh, well, then you can help me. Start, no, like, past week. Oh, I thought you were mean this. this I'm one for three. One for three. I mean, hey. I got, I got this week done, but the past two weeks didn't happen. So. Hey, I mean, the test last was week college, was, was rough for me. Yeah. I didn't do a lot. Those credits are rough. Yeah. They are. They are rough. I'm still and senioritis on a trick test from like mid last week. Senioritis is kicking in. It really is. It is and I don't I've like it because I'm like, I want to be productive. I have so many things I want to do before the end of the year. But I'm also like sad because I'm like, oh my goodness, like we're almost done. And then. We, we had a long talk about this at lunch yeah. yesterday. Just because like. We're not gonna be in the same building, which is obvious. It like kicked yeah. in, and we had that like sad senior yeah. talk, and we're like, we're yes. never gonna see each other all again, like at the same time. Yeah. But what, like, it's I so see y'all more than I see my own family. So it's just same. Kind of, like, yeah. weird to think that we're never gonna be like all together. Like, and we've like, spent like every is. day with each other for like years of our life. Literally, like, yeah. we watched yeah. each other grow up, and now we're just gonna like separate. Yeah. Literally. And even you said yesterday, even at like reunions, not everybody's gonna show up. Yeah. Yeah. So weird. That and like, crazy. and just like yeah. the people, the people that will stay at Louisville, like it's sad thinking about the people that will stay and the people that will leave and like may possibly never come back. Yeah. yeah. Like that's really sad to think about. Yeah. yeah. I'll probably be here my whole life. Me too. I won't leave. I think I might maybe like travel a little bit, but I think I'll always like come back. Like if I was gonna raise my kids, I would want to raise them around this community mm -hmm. and my family. And I don't think I could move away from my family. Yeah. I don't think so either. I. Well, me and Dakota really don't want to leave. <laughs> Dakota still. Dakota's is a basement potato. <laughs> still lives in the basement. I probably will be the same way for a while. Yeah, but he he's getting money. He's, he's making bank. He's anything, making bank. So. That's true. It's smart. Living away from mm -hmm. home. Yeah, I always thought like I would probably go away for a couple of years I mean when I kind of got into this like thought of okay I want to go into like the missionary field and like one time I even thought for like a summer I might just go do like an internship with Casas per Cristo or like something mm -hmm. like that where I would be away for a while and then like come back but I don't really know how that's going to work out because I don't really know my college plans like exactly other than that I'm going to Lakeland for either communications or business, but I mean, I think it it would be fun to travel a little bit outside of. I want to travel. Yeah. I don't know what that looks like with jobs and everything. Yeah. So. yeah. Realistically, yeah. I probably won't very much. Yeah. I think with CEO, like building connections in the area, it's mm -hmm. obviously going to be helpful for me at least having like a salon in the future, hopefully. Yeah. 
and building my network now mm -hmm. so I don't have to like move away and like struggle to find people around my area yeah. or like yeah. know my area you know what I mean like yeah. I know everyone here so it's so building your clientele yeah. will be like yeah just because yeah. you know mm -hmm. so many people yeah. and that's a need in the community yeah, and so yeah. that's really good that you get to fill that need but and it would be hard like moving away not knowing anybody yeah. to gain clients You're like starting yes. from scratch yeah. like yeah for sure yeah i feel like especially towards the end of our senior year now like we're focusing on certain things whether that be like our college plans yes or like yeah. whatever that looks like but my like main focus right now is ceo like yeah. personal business stuff like you guys have your dual credits. I have, like, CEO personal <laughs> business, and that's, like, all that's on my mind. Mm -hmm. yeah. I honestly, like, wish I would have not taken so many dual credits this semester and, like, would have had more time to work on my personal business, which I'm still working on it, and I know it's going to get done because I'm specifically putting time into my schedule where I'm like, okay, this is when I'm going to do this, or this is when I'm going to plan for that. And so it, it is teaching me life skills of like, okay, I have to like plan out my schedule because there is like not a lot of time to get a lot of things done. Mm -hmm. So definitely has been a learning experience of just like trying to figure out how to be an adult. Like, I'm mm -hmm. like, this is something that's never going to end. Like it never gets easier is what I'm learning from people I've talked to and just like, you just have to plan everything out and stay on top of stuff. So for sure. I think we have a fun game. I'm yeah. not sure what it is exactly, actually. I wasn't very... We walked in the class, and this is what Miss Cox gave us. Yeah, yeah it's we... like <laughs> trivia questions and some other things. So we, like, each are going to, like, take out a question. And then do we want to wait till the end to look at the answers? Like, just remember what yeah. questions yeah. you had? Okay. So does everyone want to go At least for those trivia ones. Yeah, I can start. And draw a question. Yeah. Here, I'll wait. We'll do it okay. time. Oh gosh. I'm not even sure what's in here. I, mean, I, I got a trivia one first thing. Okay. How many U.S. states have a city named Valentine? Is it three, four, five, or seven? Oh, wow. I, oh, yeah, I didn't even know there was. I didn't either. Is the answer like, on there? It's, we have it's on a paper, but oh, we haven't paper. looked at it. So we can guess, and I guess they can guess as well. Uh, but And then at the very end, we'll look at the answers. Okay, okay. So are we all allowed to guess? Yeah, yeah, I'd say so. Because none of us know the answer. I think it's five. Like, I feel like it'd be an in-between no, number. No. I'm going to go with five. I definitely seven. How many U.S. states have a city named Valentine? Yeah, I feel like seven, too, just because it's, like, I think seven, because there's, like, a lot. Like, I can't. Think about that's seven true. out of it's 50. It's probably going to be, like, yeah. That's fair. It's probably going to be three. Yeah, the lowest one. Yeah. I'm going so seven. Amazing. I think I'm going to go seven, too. I'm going to go five. Okay. What are you, three? I want seven. Seven? Okay. Okay. We'll see at the end. We're all going to be wrong. <laughs> Maybe it's all trivia. Yeah, I think it might Adam all be trivia. I said five. Um, what do five? the X's Adam and Cox. O's and XOXO stand for? Hugs oh, and kisses. Hugs and kisses. Right? Yeah. 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 All right, that, that was a good one. <laughs> <laughs> I think we all got that yeah. one, right? XOXO. I remember a girl. <laughs> yeah. I remember what... Oh, no, I just oh. dropped a whole bunch of them. I remember whenever we were in, like, grade school and, like, that was a thing, like, to mm -hmm. say, like, XOXO. XO, XO. <laughs> not for me. That was, like, <laughs> such a thing. <laughs> not that for the not boys. Not experience. for me. <laughs> oh, this one's a would you rather. Would you rather have a fun new experience together or get a gift you've been wanting for a while for Valentine's Day? I think experience. Experience. I love, like... Mm -hmm. Yeah, experiences over gifts, like, any day. My love language is quality time. Yeah, so for, for sure. sure. That's mine as well, and, like, that's kind of like last night when we went to the football, or football game, basketball <laughs> game. <laughs> the basketball game. Um, like, I just value, like, just spending time, like, mm -hmm. I mean, he was kind of worried, like, whenever we were like, oh, it starts at 6 instead of 7, so, like, we didn't get to go out to dinner, and he was like, but I really wanted to, like, take you out to dinner, and I was like, I still get to spend time with you. Mm -hmm. It's just, like... Having that time is what, like, matters most to me, I guess. But. Alrighty. Teach your audience? What's that mean? Like, you gotta teach like them. Like, we're what, teaching What them. would be some Valentine's-themed slang words? Oh, oh so you gotta <laughs> teach them what slang words. What are you using on Valentine's Day? Gotta raise people up, I guess. Yeah, <laughs> yeah like, if you're trying to, like, I guess... 
get a valentine like what you gotta rise them up yeah you gotta rise them up Riz is like isn't it charisma, charisma. yeah charisma like if you w riz <laughs> that w riz i don't think you know. have w riz jesse like, no but also matia's yeah. watching matia matia let us know does jesse yes, have no. w riz definitely not I don't know. I heard she got other. What are some other like slang words? I don't know if any fit Valentine's Day. Slang. Slang. Are we gonna go through all of them? Yeah, we can. Yeah. I can't think of anything. Can else. you think of any no, like pickup lines? Was there was actually like Valentine's Day pickup lines at the. I keep wanting to say football for some reason, but the basketball <laughs> players did, and it was like on the screen, and it was like, oh, what was one of the. I don't know, they they all had to say, like, a catchy pickup line, and it was so funny, because one guy one. just goes, I have a girlfriend, so, like, I don't need a pickup line, because I already got her, and it was, it was Elena funny. has a really good one. You just, <laughs> let's hear Olivia it. said pookie. <laughs> oh, my goodness, that is, like, all over my TikTok for like, you page. Yeah, it's just a nickname, I guess, that's become popular. Yeah. Uh, the actual meaning but of it the actual is, meaning yeah, is like... Not, not not cute yeah. like how people use it but there's people on tiktok who's like oh i'm pookie so yeah. it's like i don't know because that one guy who's like they're yeah. famous there's and a guy on tiktok and he's yeah. like he's like pookie's looking fine yeah. tonight like <laughs> this girl is really good on pookie today <laughs> he's like so serious about it he's yeah weird. it's so funny like it's i like, remember zach bryan did like yeah. a reaction to his video and it's the funniest yeah, thing ever funny. i love that trend <laughs> like, for that guy, it's so normal for him. Yeah, I like it's so yeah, just casual. Just say it yeah, so yeah it's so so casual. As if he's saying like honey or something. Yeah, yeah, that's I, like, like his absolutely word. Absolutely hate it. And so even in the military, his call sign is Pookie, and I was like, <laughs> no way. I was like, of course, of course, that would be your call sign. Like it can't be something cool, like bird or something. I don't know. <laughs> I was like, no, I remember, no. I remember when we went to space camp um, in seventh grade. When you went on the aviation side, you got call signs, and like, mine was T Bone. Like, I say it was yeah. better than Pookie. Yeah, I yeah. would say too. But like, yeah. but like the all the all the um direct, uh, what do you call it? Like leaders, I guess, or mm -hmm. whatever you call it. I don't know. Um, they had like all just the weirdest, the weirdest call signs you'll ever you'll ever <laughs> see. Oh yeah, goodness. they all have like. I want to know how that came yeah. about for him. Just because um, it's like a thing right now. Or yeah, no? they all call each other like honey and. Oh. Like, I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's weird to me. I don't understand it. <laughs> Do you want to know another one? I think we each have enough for one more. Okay. That's good. Another trivia. What percentage of flowers purchased on Valentine's Day are red? I think oh, sorry. I thought, she, oh. I thought she put the answer <laughs> is. And, okay, anyway. Is the answer 69%, 76%, 83%, or 94%? What was the question? How many? What percentage? Oh, yeah. What percentage of flowers are purchased on Valentine's Day that, that are, are red? red? Oh. Was it? I feel like maybe Definitely 83. up there. I feel like it's the highest. It's I think it's no. 83. It's below the I bet it's 83. top percent, but... Because I feel like oh, well, roses pink are popular, but I think white. pink, yeah. Yes, pink and white. Okay. Pink, white and pink have gotten more popular, I think. Okay. Yeah, and then they're like, I know the mustard seed is like colored ones, like colored yeah. roses and stuff, so. Yeah. I feel like 94. When I was at, when I was at work I can today, see that though. We, we, need to know, we need to know what color flowers you got for Mrs. Cox. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if any. And if yeah. not, get to it. If not, go to the store. Get to right it today. <laughs> when, I was, when I was at um, work today, there were so many people getting flowers. Oh, yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah. I like, so I'm, I'm, right, I'm right, right across, but like, there's so many. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's funny. Uh, yeah, I'd say 76 or 83. Probably 83. That was like me and Kelly went to Walmart on Monday night and literally the amount of guys carrying out like flowers and chocolates and stuff. I'm like, okay, it's like not that early, but it's like, mm -hmm. you're getting, like the flowers are going to be dead, bro. Yeah, like, yeah. <laughs> Well, so we went to Evansville. Oh, I don't even remember what day it was. I don't remember this last weekend and we went to Target mm -hmm. and they had like their flower wall and yeah. then they had roses down the aisle. And um, it was like, twenty dollars for a bouquet of roses mm -hmm. and ethan just starts picking all of them up i was like did you not look at the price tag like twenty dollars you're picking up like eighty dollars worth of flowers he was like oh and i was like yeah that's a lot cheaper there because yeah. like when you go to a floral 
A flower shop. Floral. Yeah, I was gonna say florist, the florist, but I can't yeah. say it anyway. Um, it is really expensive, yeah. especially roses. Roses mm-hmm. are pricey. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're like the most expensive flower, I think. Yeah, it's crazy. Yeah. So Walmart's the way to go if you don't care. <laughs> Adam, that will be a great mystery. <laughs> well, it better happen. She's probably watching this right now, so. Yeah. <laughs> Would you rather stay in or go out on Valentine's Day? We kind of talked about it. Yeah. yeah. I, I think either one. Yeah. I think I'm in with whatever. But I'm also kind of like a, I'd rather go out in general. Yeah. yeah. Have like a nice dinner. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I feel like you could always stay in, but that's, you can't always go. That's what I you told Brendan yeah. yeah. last you night. Can. I said that. I was like, I gave an option, and then he's like, well, what cost me less money? And I was like, well, I don't it's really want to do that one. <laughs> yeah. It's like, we can do that any day. <laughs> yeah, I think go out. Okay. Let's see here. Oh, goodness. <laughs> oh, goodness. <laughs> good try. Keep going. <laughs> I get all the paper. Okay. Valentine's Day trivia. How many cards are sent on Valentine's Day each year? Is it 500 million, 1 billion, 2 billion, or 10 billion cards? So, like, sent, like, meaning through the mail? Well, there's 7 billion like people in the world, so there's definitely not 10 billion. <laughs> I there's just de- good. There's well, definitely not 10 billion. There's no way. There's no way each person did more multiple, than one. Yeah, yeah. Well, you're yeah. Right, you're right. There's That's no true. way. And not every person. Yeah, because not even everyone sends one, and then mm-hmm. there's no way. I'll say. Well, and some people. I'm saying five hundred. I'm saying five hundred million. I, that's what I was gonna say. Just think about it. Look at all the guys in our school. All, all but five of them maybe yeah. sent a card. And not everybody actually like gets cards. That's, that's what yeah. I'm thinking. Like I'm, you. A lot of people just like I feel yeah, like actually them. give or them. write like letters or something. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I'm thinking five hundred mil. Yeah. I'm going totally. to a billion because <laughs> think about the whole world. Okay, know? that's yeah. true. Maybe one billion. There's like seven, 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 whatever, some billion people. Yeah, There's no yeah. way. I'll, I'll go know. one Two billion. billion. So I that's feel like, like that's, that's fair. literally like one. So let's just say one in every three people. Olivia's apart. saying these guys need to step up. <laughs> that's what she's saying. <laughs> she's I saying, mean, there's well, no reason can, that two billion people. She has people faith in the guys. Yeah, I do not. That's true. Well, can't, or, we don't know if it means actually like sent through the mail yeah, or like, given. If it's like mail, I'm thinking one billion, two billion. It's but 500 if million. It's, see, now y'all are switching up because you're thinking about it. No, nope, it's like, 500 yeah. million. Question, will up. Mrs. Cox pay six dollars for a Valentine's Day? <laughs> I don't know. Um, she'll probably have one of us make it on camera <laughs> and yeah. That's true. I got Charlie a funny card for Valentine's Day. I was like, I don't want to do one of those I like lovey dovey ones. I ended up not doing it. I did a funny one, and I think it was six dollars. <laughs> but it's right. really funny. It's the last one. Would you rather plan your Valentine's date together or get surprised with a date already planned? They already get planned. surprised. Yeah. See, it's yeah. like what me and Elena were saying. Like, if we don't have to plan anything, it's wonderful. That's awesome. Yes. <laughs> so you don't plan the date. You don't plan Jessie? anything. Me and Tia have only ate out one time. Really? Yeah, really? we just never have time. Oh yeah, that's very good. We're always we're we're both two sport athletes. Yeah, that, that's hard. true. That's still surprising. You've been yeah. together for a really long time. Yeah. It is really nice though to not have to plan it. Yeah. Like we, just, get we definitely, but like, like no, that. we still like go like we do things all yeah. the time. But yeah, we just like going out to eat one like with just the two of us one time. Mm-hmm. Really? That's, yeah. Mm-hmm. Me and Ethan's first day, he was literally just like, be ready at this time. Like, mm, that's what really Charlie did. did. Him. And I was like, okay. Made reservations at Firefly and everything. Like, got it all set up. So, me and Brent's first date, both of us couldn't drive. So, <laughs> that's fair. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know our first actual date. <laughs> Jesse, you're getting like roasted. One time. Who said that? One Adam. time. <laughs> Adam's fault, like, Adam. are you serious? It's not my fault, Adam. He's like, Come it's on. okay, you can make up for it now. That's right, yeah. Summer, That's right. It's fine. I literally don't think I planned a single date. Because I told Charlie, like, in the beginning, I'm like, I love, like, man with a plan. Mm-hmm. I'm like, I don't really like to, like, choose stuff like that. And so I'm just like, wherever you want to go, whatever you want to do... And that's what he told me. He was like, be ready by this time. Like, I'm going to pick you up. And then he did give me the option. He was like, do you want to go play arcade games? Or do you want to go back to my house? Like, it was kind of just like he gave me choices. So, Mm -hmm. like, that was nice. But 
I like having it planned out in like a sense, but also I love like getting in the car and being like, I want this, I want this. Because oh, yeah. 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 I'm also like very well, high maintenance, I feel like, in that way, where I'm, I'm like, answer. oh, I'm craving Chipotle. Literally. We're getting Chipotle. And Brandon is actually <laughs> very good at satisfying the cravings I have. Yeah. I'm like, can we please go to Abigail? Can we please go? So, and yeah. we end up going. But <laughs> I'm like, we can get ginger ale after. Yeah. I'm like, I'll buy you something. Yeah. Which never lets me know, but <laughs> I offer. <laughs> I offer to, I but it never has worked. I I have planned something for like his birthday, and yes. I yeah. know he'll try to pay for stuff. So, so like I paid online for a movie like so that he wouldn't like whatever. Yeah. Which he ended up paying for popcorn because he wouldn't let me. But like, <laughs> I tried. Yeah, <laughs> I tried. Okay, are you ready Just for the answers? answers? Yeah, let's hear the answers. We don't. I don't even know what time this class ends. We usually are still on when the bell, the bell rings. I think it's soon. Thirty-eight. What time is it now? Thirty-three. Or maybe okay. it's 35. It was one billion coins. <gasps> Yay! What? So I'm telling you, it, I yeah. knew it was going to be in the We billions. need to ask her if it's was six right. or whatever. That's like a seventh of people. Yeah. One in seven. Yeah. Um, it was 69% red roses. Oh. I don't wow, remember what I even I did the 84. That was the lowest yeah. one. Yeah, I said 70. I think I did like the 80, yeah. Yeah, the 80 something. I um, mean, XOXO, we got that. Mm -hmm. Um, Four? For, for the states. cities. For states. Yeah. Oh. oh. There's wow. Valentine. Way over. That's close. Yeah. Yes. Valentine, Arizona. Hold up. <laughs> Nebraska, <laughs> Texas, and Virginia. Hmm. Cool. I didn't even know anywhere was called that. <laughs> That's cool, though. More you know, I guess. Well, you know how many places trip. are called Louisville? Oh yeah, and there's like Louisville. There's a lot of Springfields too. Yeah. yeah. Yes, Which, that's true. Like I like so many states have Springfield. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Which ours is like it was the Lewis family, so I'm always shocked why we're not spelled yes. L E W. -I so actually, working oh, at really? the genealogy library, I learned about that because yeah. I always wondered that too, and they told me that. Whenever, like, they went to get, like, our name, like, officially established. There was already, there was already a Louisville. The, the post, the, like, card that had it, they spelled it wrong. Oh. It was supposed to be Lewis, like, L-E-W-I-S, yeah. like, the Lewis family. But the person who actually wrote it down officially spelled it, like, Louisville. I didn't spelled. even know that. Yeah. That's cool. I think I Googled that one time. That's yeah. how I learned. I think it's funny when people say Louisville. Yeah. Or yes. Louisville. So many Louisville. people. Louisville. So yeah. many people call it Louisville. Yep. We're Louisville, actually. <laughs> but for sports, for sports, it's always weird because, like, we're Louisville, but, like, our school's called North Clay. Yeah. Yes. So, like, they're like, what is a North Clay? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But north of Clay County, but. Yeah. Which is the different, like, Clay Cities is Clay City, Florence, Florida. Yeah. 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 Bingham's yeah. I never thought like, about that. We're like the sure. only like the only school around that does that too. Yeah. Well, I mean, South Central. I mean, there's like St. Anthony and all that. Yeah, they're but private they're private. School. But yeah, you're right. Yeah. Because there's, there's still like Anthony. I guess there is South Central. South Central does that. But I can't think mm. of anybody else. Mm. Hmm. Good topic. We might have to yeah. discuss that yeah. in the podcast. That's a good yeah. Towns sure. and the like mascots. Yeah. No. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we kind of talked over it. Okay. Mom's but anyway, I think that's all we've got for today. But that was fun. That we was should definitely fun do trivia again. That was a good, a good game. What's our next holiday? Easter. St. Patrick's Day. St. Patrick's Day. Is there a lot of trivia about that? Huh? We can film it behind the green I'm screen. Sure. I'm sure there's a lot of. We can look up like Irish heritage yeah. or something. Like, Most likely we, we, we find don't. Something. We will Most learn a jig know. dance and yes, on TikTok. I'm an Irish whatever. An Irish you jig. You know when Mr. Poss played us Irish yes. pub music? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh my His god. His Irish pub yes. music. Yeah, and we're all positive. Yeah, that was fun. Um, I remember Miss Karen would always get us in trouble because. Like you pinch people and Miss Karen, oh, yeah. Miss Karen was on that. I forgot yeah. about that. <laughs> yeah, and then we just tell everybody we were wearing like green socks or green underwear, so they couldn't. <laughs> so <they're> good, yeah. <laughs> um. Yeah, I always forget about that holiday for some yeah. reason. <laughs> yeah, me too. The only reason I remember is because green is like one of my favorite colors, so I'm like, I remember. Day to wear green. I, 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 I do not like green. I don't yeah. think I own like a single green clothing. Really? I could just I wear my prom dress either. from last year. It was <laughs> neon green, but I actually have Please a lot do. of green Bring clothes. Yes. Should no, I actually? I honestly, I honestly don't think I have a green shirt or hoodie. Really? Watch this. Paris has like a perfect Saturday. dress that you can borrow. Yeah. yeah. That's right. You can borrow my Giovanni. It's it's pretty. <laughs> well. But. The bell rang. We had. Yeah, yeah the bell ring. We probably should go to our next guest. And the second bell's about to ring. Yeah. Soon.
Yeah. So thanks for tuning in. We hope you have a great Valentine's Day. Hopefully you got your husband or wife flowers and yeah. <laughs> Elena, That's all we got. Elena, you have to turn it off. Oh, well. I was going to say, if you wanted to do I'm that. I'm not doing it. I'm it's not really hard when you're Bye. Bye, guys.